Hi guys, Justine from yourdino.com here. I wanted to show you some new cool features that we got. And the first one is results table. So this is the graphs that you're used to, of course, but now we can also look at the uh, results in a table. So here you have the master channel set to RPM. So for every 250 RPM, you see the results like that. Uh, you can, of course, change that the interval to be something else. Let's say every 100. Then you have a, a bigger table like that. You can also change what you want to look at. With the usual V button, you turn on and off uh, whatever channels uh, you would like here, right? So that's uh, pretty cool. Um, so let's see. Uh, we have uh, another thing here. As you can see, this is a master channel. Uh, set to RPM, but it can be set to any channel here. Maybe more useful would be time. So here for every second, you have now uh, the results. You can, of course, uh, also here set the interval to something different. Okay, um, let's turn on uh, another run visible as well. Test number two. Then it comes like here, here. so you can, you can uh, compare the two runs uh, like that. Let's turn on RPM and then I'll set to go back to RPM. Okay, uh, another thing which is very useful is if you right click again and you select open in Excel, automatically Excel is opened and uh, here is all your results. And here you can play around with uh, whatever you like, right? Uh, you can make uh, virtual channels or plot or, or do whatever. So that's uh, good for those of you who like Excel. And uh, of course, if you don't have Excel or want the data in some other format, you just uh, select them and right click and then click copy. And then you can open it in whatever you like. Okay, pretty cool, huh? Then we have the print function, which is uh, quite good as well. You can look at the print preview. And here you can see how it looks on paper with the uh, test one here, test two here, and uh, the, the summary under here. And uh, it will just continue until it's done with all the lines. Of course, if you click, uh, have too many um, channels uh, visible, so it's gonna span over more than one page. It's actually sp spent quite some effort to make it nice. Now you see we get one run uh, li like that at the time here another run comes in the next page like this so we can compare and have a nice nice print okay good uh, <clears throat> so the other new feature is also related to tables and it's this uh, summary table under here it looks uh, kind of similar to before but uh, now it's much more configurable so if you right click you will see here a list of available data that you can show in this menu right so you can turn on and off things uh, as as you like so it's quite useful. There is uh, now a few more uh, informations available uh, around the environmental correction factors and power correction factors. So we can we can turn them on here and, and look at them. So the environmental conditions are the same as before, <clears throat> but now we can also show which type of environmental uh, correction factor was, was used. You see the factor that came out of that uh, calculation, uh, the power correction if you have any, and the total correction factor here. So uh, in a typical uh, setup, maybe you want to remove that, but you can turn them on if you like, it's, it's up to you. Uh, you can also sort uh, and move uh, columns around like you want. Uh, here we can have can sort on name or maybe you want to sort on time you want to have the newest on top or the newest uh, on the bottom now you can set it up uh, exactly as as you like what's also good is that if you do a print a print preview exactly the same stuff that you the same data that you defined uh, uh, will be on the printout so uh, that's the same of course if you go on uh, on the graph here you can uh, select the, the columns you want and the same thing will appear in the print uh, preview like that so it's very much more configurable now compared to before all right guys that's what i wanted to show today quite a lot of work behind these two tables uh, and i hope you find them useful and uh, happy tuning